Before the break, we asked, approximately how much does the average American manufacturing worker earn per hour? Is it A, $10, B, $15, or C, $20? The answer is C. The average American manufacturing worker makes approximately $20 per hour, not including benefits. Earlier this season, Ray came to Hatch Business Solutions looking for an investment to turn his liquid vitamin into a retail success. My goal is to get people on a road to better health. The panel got a healthy dose of his charm. Well, I'll give you this much, my young friend. You are passionate, and those teeth are spectacular. You could light up a billboard with that smile. And he walked away with a once-in-a-lifetime deal with Hatch Business Solutions. Oh. Boost has finally hatched! Let's see what he's up to now. Since hatched, things have been unbelievable. Sales have gone through the roof. The day I went on hatched, it was literally my biggest day of sales ever. The marketing that I got from the show was unbelievable. We've quadrupled production. The volume exploded so much, I had to find a new manufacturer because we outgrew the old guys. They couldn't handle it anymore. So today, I brought you guys a Creative Essences, my new manufacturer, because I want you to see how we make Boost. This is where the magic happens. I want to give you guys a sneak peek into how we actually make Boost and honestly, all the steps that are involved. So right here, we've got the filling station that fills bottles three at a time. From there, we've got to put a cap on it. These are induction seal caps. You'll see a metal foil inside there. We put this cap on the bottle, we run it through an induction sealer, and that metal foil is magnetically sealed onto the bottle. Bam! Sealed on, tight, that's not spilling anywhere. Once we've sealed the bottle, this is where my babies need new clothes. Layla's putting the shrink sleeves on the bottle. We send these bottles through the steam tunnel, and then those shrink sleeves will tailor themselves to the bottle. I like to be tailored, and I like my product to be tailored as well. So as you can see, this is an assembly line. This makes for an efficient manufacturing process. We can make 7,000 of these a day now, so we can really, really keep up with the demand. Part of being a business owner is you've got to continue to refine your systems and make them more efficient. And with Hatch Business Solutions, we've been able to do that. When Ray first pitched his liquid vitamins, the Hatch panel thought the flavor was a bitter pill to swallow. It's an unusual taste. I'm trying to get my tongue to start tasting again. <laughs> Listen, vitamins, if they taste too good, they're probably loaded with sugar. That does not have sugar. So one of the big things that was important to me coming out of the show was to act on the feedback from Patch Business Solutions. So luckily, with my new manufacturer, there's an amazing chemist named LV, and she is helping me make it taste better. I don't want to have any added sugars. I don't want anything artificial, but I'd love to see if we can make that taste better. I prepared the taste test for you. Oh, great. Actually, I got three options for you to try. Let's do it. OK. Ray is very picky, especially with his product. So I'm really hoping Ray will approve one of this trial that I made for him. So this is the first option. You know, to be honest, like, that was not that different. Let's try this second This is one. number two. Wow, that one's really sweet. You told me not to put any sugar, yeah. but I tricked you on that. <laughs> Did you really? I added a little bit of sugar just to see how good is your taste bud. All right, so number two, you're out. We're not adding sugar. So All this right. is number three. That tasted Great. This is it. It's number three. You didn't add any didn't artificial put, flavors, no, no artificial, artificial colors. No artificial sweetener, nothing. We just boost one ingredient that is already here in That's your ingredients. That's LV nailed it. I think this new taste is going to be perfect. I love number three, and I'm going to get Freddie from Hatch Business Solutions in and get his sign off. Freddie wasn't that crazy about the taste. So I'm very nervous for his feedback. For him to really put his energy behind Boost, we've got to make him love it. Coming up, 
Will the new flavor go down smooth with Freddy? What do you think, man? What do you think? Today's an incredibly important day for Boost. We've got Freddie Cameron from Hatched Business Solutions coming here. He's gonna be able to taste the new and improved Boost liquid multivitamin. We had to improve the taste because of all the feedback from the consumers and really the panel. So when it came to the consumer's feedback on the taste of your product, only a third of consumers liked the taste. It's incredibly important for Freddie to test it and approve it because without that sign off, I can't move forward on the retail front. I get it, I understand that taste is important. Taste is always the important thing. I mean, if it doesn't taste good, who's gonna buy it? So if it tastes bad, I have no problem telling them, hey, you gotta go back to the drawing board, redo this. My reputation's on the line, his reputation's on the line, the whole hatch process is on the line. What you are about to taste is the new and improved Boost Liquid Daily Multivitamin. I can't tell what he thinks. Normally I can read people's faces, but this guy, I have no idea. He's like stone-faced. I wanna like stick my hand in his throat and pull out his words and say, what do you think, man? What do you think? You nailed it, brother. <laughs> this is really good. And it tastes like juice. It does taste yeah, like juice. Yeah, it's just a great taste, so I think you nailed it. <laughs> he loved it. He loved it. Hey, this product has a Freddy Cameron thumbs up, so congratulations, sir. The double thumbs, thumbs up. Thumbs up. We got the two big thumbs up that I needed. With Freddy's stamp of approval, we can go into the retail market full steam ahead with his unconditional support. I feel good. The taste is good, manufacturing is on point, so I believe Ray is setting itself up for success. The team at Hatch Business Solutions has been fantastic. I'm blessed to have the resources and the team behind me to take this thing to where I know it can go.